Kunari. Bust it on him.
believe those Kunari attacked the Inquisition on sight. Kunari soldiers always have orders. The Kunes declared us an enemy. Are you saying the entire Kunari nation wants us dead? That's Fen Harel. Removing the face markings from a Dalish elf? Not Dalish. They weren't Dalish yet, right? Maybe the markings used to have a different meaning?
weapons. These freed slaves actually fought back against the Evanuris posing as gods. Elven mages who hoarded power and slaves? One could see parallels to Tevinter's magisters. The Dalish are going to shit themselves. This letter says the Kunari came to these ruins because the Alluvians connect to Halam Sharal. An attack on the Winter Palace? It was some sort of infiltration. There's no more details. Darling, this 
breakfast room at Chateau Ghislaine. You have a different breakfast room for every season? A century ago, it was in fashion to have a different room for every meal and every day of the week. When that fad ended, the Dukes of Ghislaine converted most of the rooms to closets. Storage is timeless. Anything that explains why the Kunari came here before we go. about an unknown intruder coming through an alluvian. They turned spirits against us, then fled. A mage. They must have fought their way out, then let the spirits finish off the Kunari. Two parties, then. The Kunari and a mystery agent determined to stop them. Come on. We have to warn people about the Kunari's designs on the Winter Palace. One dead canary was bad enough. Now we have more, and they're hostile. This makes no sense. The canary may not be friendly to the Inquisition, but they have no reason to attack us. They also have no reason to be here, or using Illuvians at all. I've had the mirror placed under guard for now, Your Holiness. Cullen, please just call me Liliana. Yes, Your uh, Liliana. It appears the relative peace and quiet of the last two years is coming to an end. First the Blight, then Mages and Templars, then Corythias, and now this. Can't we go ten years without the world falling to pieces? We must ensure that the Kunari do not disrupt the negotiations. The Exalted Council is in a very delicate state. I'm certain you can soothe the nobles' ruffled feathers while we solve the real problem. Not when the Inquisitor insults everyone present by walking out in the middle of the talks. Our only advantage is that Orle and Ferelden are divided in goal and grievance. If they unite against us, Divine Victoria will have no choice but to support their claims. We could lose everything. Could we use the Kunari threat to remind everyone how valuable the Inquisition still is? Not until we know more. It will be fine. I will attend to the Exalted Council. And while Josie does that, we will investigate. We, Your Holiness? <sighs> you do, Josie? I'll head back to the crossroads. We need to find out what the Kunari are doing and why they attacked. And I'll have a quiet word with our honor guard.
tell me, these strange spaces past the Alluvians, are they safe to explore? We're taking every precaution we can, Josephine. I will take your word for it. And yet, you've accomplished so much in the calm of these past years. I wish you did not have to imperil yourself for us. Again. I must admit, after years of dinners and paperwork, it feels good to go exploring again. I only wish you had fewer Canari interrupting your stroll. I will do what I can here. Once the Canari are dealt with, brace yourself. The Council is just as relentless. It is good to see you. going all right so far I don't understand how you could just become a Viscount when the ruler of a marcher state dies and there's no heir the nobles of the city pick a new ruler. only none of Kirkwall's nobles actually want the throne most of them think it's cursed actually they can't leave it empty though or some other state like Starkhaven or Ansberg will probably invade I complained about the empty office when it interfered with my reconstruction efforts. They took that as volunteering. I'm surprised no one from the Council of Heralds wants your autograph. You just missed them. Duke Cyril keeps asking me for spoilers for my next book. So Bran used to be Viscount, and now he just follows you around? Provisional Viscount. Pretty much. With a permanent appointee, finally, in the Viscount's office, I am free to return to my post as Seneschal. He means my true calling is arrogantly telling people they can't talk to the Viscount. He's good at it, too. We'll talk more another time. I'll be here if you need me. Everything going all right so far? We'll talk more another time. I'll be here if you need me. something you needed? Have you had a chance to speak with Liliana? Away from work, I mean. Some, yes. Liliana has kept in contact, unofficially, of course, but it's good to see her again. Arguing with her in person is far more satisfying. Do you remember the first time we came to the Winter Palace? All too well. I've already answered a half dozen questions about my personal life. The reason we're here is because we made a difference. That's worth enduring the political small talk. Is there any news from Ferelden? How is your family? My sister Mia keeps me informed. As I understand, she's training my nephew to best me at chess. All good news, then? Not all, but most of it is, and that's good enough. Is there anything I should know? We were permitted soldiers here, but our every move is watched. Some things never change. I should go. Inquisitor?
to see you, my friend. What is this ambassadorship about, exactly? I believe my father set it up, but... ...the Imperium certainly didn't object. They'd love for the Inquisition to fall apart. So they're happy if it seems they consider this council a waste of time. That... ...makes no sense. No? If Dredtavinter actually pushed for the Inquisition's end... ...everyone else would disagree on principle. So they send a nobody pariah and hope for the best. Makes perfect sense to me. What did you do in Tevinter while you were away? I went home. Twice. The father was only there once. Mother was drunk both times. I also went to Carinus to see my good friend Mayveris. Then I settled some of Alexis's affairs. That wasn't fun. Any thoughts about the Exalted Council? A few. Divine Victoria needs a new tailor for one. From the paintings of Liliana in that enormous robe, you'd think she was pregnant. Could cause a delicious scandal. As for this whole Exalted Council business, well... I warned you once that no one would thank you for saving the world. Sadly, I'm always right. So long as the Inquisition's around to remind them they're not really in charge, they'll never sleep comfortably. Whether they have the guts to take action, I suppose we'll see. Another time. I look forward to it. Darling, what can I do for you? How are things for the Circle of Magi? If you call it the Circle while they're in earshot, you'll never hear the end of it, my dear. The College of Enchanters is a ridiculous mess, but it's still a useful institution for training mages. I wanted your opinion of how Divine Victoria is working out. Leliana is managing to hold the Chantry together, just barely. Likely your influence. We'll talk another time. Divine Victoria. <laughs> Please don't. It would be nice to just be Liliana again for a few days. Oh, of course. Forgive me. There's nothing to forgive. I just want it to be like old times. Tell me about your nugs. Did you get any new ones? Oh, yes. A litter was born just a month ago. We are weaning them right now. If you are hoping for one, I'm afraid they're already spoken for. How are things between you and the hero of Ferelden? <sighs> we see each other whenever we can. There is gossip, of course. People will call me inappropriate. But love is one of the Maker's greatest gifts, and nothing to be ashamed of. Start and end with love, and everything else falls into place. As Divine, I have tried to spread this message. It's taken some time, but I think people are listening, especially now. Do you miss being our spy master? I think I miss the people more than the work. Josie, Cullen... I didn't notice how much I liked having them near until they weren't. We're right, of course, but it's not the same. 
Have your agents any news I should hear about? There is activity in the Tirishon. Strange elves, like those of the Temple of Methal. No news of Solus, however. Perhaps later, Liliana. I'd be right here if you need anything. Well met, your worship. She killed the girl to save herself. She thinks about the eyes going black. A weapon is an order, not a gift. The Guardian's spirit stayed, not bound, but biding, because he asked. He knows how to speak, so spirits listen. It was the same boy. His mother on the ship, his father in their homeland. He grew up lonely, or didn't. Hello, and shh. I'm trying to figure out why everyone is acting so weird. I mean, besides because Canary assassins and everything. You see it, right? There's something going with the elf servants. Makes sense after that ruin, right? When you start going on about elves, it's hard to tell if it's about them or you. Yes, yes, you're ever so clever, arse. Point is, the servants have no complaints. No asking for a Jenny. They serve this lot, but don't want them done for anything. So, the nobles are nice and the servants are happy? Two things that have never been true. Mark that I said it. We're fighting Canari, but something else is on the up. I suppose you've a lot to say about that elven ruin. About the creators. They're not even demons. Just big magey knobs punching down. And yes, the shits who use them to make me feel broken can still eat it. But always waiting for that fight is way too much work. It's like doing half the hurt for them. Maybe we're old now, but I'm tired of it. We've new fights to look forward to. We always do, seems like. It's been a couple years. How's everything sitting with you? It's weird meeting back up and seeing everyone get their grey. First time I've been anywhere long enough to get fond of things. Leliana's friendly when she wants to be, 
My people sometimes do things for her, like I do for you. And all for Andraste, I suppose. It still rings right, but the way people used to go on about it, I thought there'd be more trumpets. We'll talk later. Count on seeing you, yeah? So, you and the Bard. You know most Bards are spies, right? You were a spy, Chief. <sighs> Look, I just don't want you to get... burned. Don't say it. Because then you'd be... <sighs> Creme brulee! <laughs> Creme brulee! <laughs> Creme, I understand you and Meriden are seeing each other? Ah, uh, yes, Your Worship. I mean, we just started, so... Oh, come on. Get in there, show her what you can do. Listen, Chief, there's this thing you may not have learned growing up Canary and all. Hey, I'm great at foreplay. That's... good to know, Bull. I didn't mean foreplay, I meant courtship. Oh, well, that's a waste of time. You two are good, though, right? You need me to talk to her about... things? No! Uh, no, no. Thanks, though. We're good. The Chargers have been with the Inquisition for a while now. Is everyone still happy? No complaints, Your Worship. The Inquisition's been good to us. We'd disband and join the Inquisition officially, but the Chief gets this sad dog look when we suggest it. The loyalty is touching, Krem. I'll talk to you later. Any time, boss. Wish I hadn't burned all my contacts with the Ben Hasrath. Be nice to have some idea what they're doing right now. Yeah, but then you'd be on their side, Chief. Yes, but I'd know things. I like knowing things. I'll talk to you later. Any time, boss. How did Varric, of all people, become the Viscount of Kirkwall? A mystery for the ages. I hear you've been rebuilding the Seekers. Slowly, but yes. I managed to find a few of my former comrades who'd scattered to the winds. Some of them were unsuitable, and I did not ask them to return. Others felt as I did once they read the Lord Seeker's tome. We've since recruited a few candidates who are going through training now, with full disclosure. What comes after this... I cannot be certain. I'm making it up as I go along. <laughs> Sounds familiar. I thought you'd appreciate that. So what do you think of the Chantry? You ask me just to poke at me and see if I react, don't you? It is what it is. Most Holy's reforms are interesting, to say the least. I hope they last once Liliane is gone. Regardless of what I think, it could have been far worse. You and I both remember the dark times we faced. Sadly, others have far shorter memories. What do you think of the Exalted Council? 
They are frightened of your power, and there is no longer a hole in the sky to remind them that it was needed. They might be right. Do not say that near them unless you want to give them the scent of blood. Even so, I would wait and see where this leads. Karma heads may yet prevail. <laughs> when has that ever been the case? I'm an optimist. Just ask Varric. I'll see you later. Farewell. Need me for anything? You're more comfortable being called by your real name now. Comfortable? Not quite yet. I didn't want to be Rainier for such a long time. To be quite frank, he was an ass. But he's... I've changed. And reclaiming my name has allowed me to reconnect with people I haven't seen in years. Family. It wouldn't have happened without you. It's nice to have everyone back in the same place again. <laughs> I have to admit I missed it. What does it mean when we need a huge diplomatic talk or the world ending just to bring us together? I got the chance to have a few drinks with Sarah. Miss that girl. It's still a little awkward talking to Cassandra. But the commander appears to have forgiven me. Finally. What do you think's going to happen at the Exalted Council? Maker, I have no idea. Politics always makes my head spin. The Inquisition shouldn't have to give in whenever some prissy noble gets their knickers wedged somewhere. Until later. At your pleasure, my lady.
once. something here. Better take a closer look. Where is that servant? Where is that servant? Might be something here. Better take a closer look.
has it been? And what did they need? All is well, it seems. All is well, it seems. I don't know. Those Ferelders, always afraid to be.
Arbreuil must be here. 